Hard to believe, but it's, it won't be long before we experience scenes like this. But before winter weather grips Middle Tennessee, discussions are already underway about how to protect homeless people in Nashville from the cold. One Metro Council member thinks more can be done. News Channel 5's Emily Luxon looks at what he's proposing. I'm just trying to drive discussion. In front of the Metro Homelessness Commission, Council Member Jim Shulman tried to rally support for a bill he says would help protect homeless residents. I think government's responsible for its citizens, you know, primarily, and if we've got people being left out in the cold, then I want to do something about it. Shulman's bill would require Metro to open and operate an additional shelter when it's 32 degrees or below. Currently, Metro's cold weather community response plan relies on partners like Room in the Inn and the Rescue Mission to operate shelters. Metro will only open an overflow shelter if it's 25 degrees or below. Homeless advocates like Howard Allen support Shulman's bill. He says the change will provide some much needed additional space and another option for residents. But right now it will bring us in where we can come in. All we want to do is have a warm place, be able to sleep, get something to eat and not cause any trouble and then get up and try to make it through the next day. However, some critics say the bill lacks specifics and doesn't address costs. The Homelessness Commission estimates it will take $8,000 a night to operate the shelter, and the bill doesn't address the bigger issue of the need for affordable housing. In my mind, it can only help, but I also always want to state we need to look at a systems approach and have these discussions to get people in. Homelessness is a crisis, regardless of the weather. Shulman is still hopeful the bill can make a difference. I want a simple plan. I want something simple and straightforward. Surely we can we can figure out how to do that. The bill comes up for second reading at the next Metro Council meeting on Tuesday. Meanwhile, the Homelessness Commission will continue to discuss the issue with community partners. Reporting at the Metro Courthouse, Emily Luxon, News Channel 5. And if you'd like to read more specifics on Metro's cold weather community response plan, head to this story on newschannel5.com.